Hello everyone. We have two young kids in the family. To prevent them from going to the swimming pool unattended, I decided to install this fence. On the first attempt though, I accidentally punctured an underground irrigation pipe. Ouch. Not a great job, isn't it? Let's fix it. To fix my mess, I had to buy a PVC pipe joiner. In order to cut appropriately the two pipes, or actually the pipe on both sides, I also purchased this PVC pipe cutter. It's very handy and it allows you to make a very nice and sharp cut on both ends, as you will see. Just ignore the fact that the shot is completely out of focus, but focus on the size of the hole. That was quite a big one. Prior to installing the tube joiner, it's really recommended to clean both sides of the pipe. In order to remove dirt and other type of, you know, remainers, that will prevent a perfect fit once you install it. Installing the two ends of the joiner it's not as easy as it might look like because there is a lot of friction on purpose because you want it to be very watertight. But you know, once you've done the first one, it's quite easy to do the second. Just make sure that all the pieces are inserted in the right order, otherwise, you know, bad surprises will follow. Screwing up. Literally, the centerpiece was not as convenient and comfortable because of the position. But you know, hopefully you will have pipes in a more accessible location. Just screw one end and then repeat with the other. And while you admire my elbow grease, I just want to remind you that in the description below you will find a link to both the PVC pipe cutter and the pipe joint that I used in this project. To insert the second pipe in the joiner, you will actually have to bend both of them a little bit, so make sure you have enough room for that. Just push it in, and once it's inserted, then it's a matter of screwing up again. You know, no, not really screwing up, but you get it. What I really like about this system is that you don't really need any additional tool, sealer, silicone or anything else. The pipe joiner itself will be enough to create a perfect seal between the two parts of the pipe. Pretty cool, huh? It's really important to screw as tight as possible both extremities in order to prevent any possible leaks in the future. Probably the most annoying part of the whole project, of course. Well, with the exception of digging the hole. But definitely worth the result. Look at this! It's raining! Wanna shower? No leaks! It works! And here's when I should tell you to subscribe, right?